Hello friends. Today I'm going to speak a little bit about mold. Now I talk a lot about mold. In fact, some of my friends get very irritated because I'm always talking about mold. You know, one day we had somebody walk by us in a restaurant and I said, oh my goodness, do you smell the mold on that person? So I'm very sensitive to mold. Now, why am I so sensitive to mold? Well, in Levi Leviticus 13 and Leviticus 14, the Bible talks about mold, and it says how we need to remove this mold from our garments and from our homes. So it is that important that it is in the Bible. So I take it very personal that we need to be cognizant of what we're doing with mold. Now, some of us have something called HLA-DRBQ. That's a genetics where we can't remove mycotoxins from our body. But also, do you know that even if you don't have that gene, you can still have mold toxicity? There is a test I use called Real-Time Lab that helps test for mold and mold toxicity. Now, when we do that, then you can see if your mold levels are high. If they're high, then we definitely need to take this into consideration and do something about it. Mold is associated with over 36 diseases. Irritable bowel, Crohn's, ulcerative colitis, all kinds of other gastric issues and uh, other diseases. So these are serious and they really affect us and how we live. I have a way that we remove these molds from our body. And sometimes it's just supplements. Other times people will need IV treatments. But it's different for every single person depending on their genetics. So friends, take it serious. Inspect your home. Live and live excellently.